Hi guys, welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, meron tayong passport problem coming from Engineering Sciences and Allied Subjects, which is what we know as ESAS, from the Electrical Engineering Boards, September 2019. Pero before that, shoutout muna kay Alan James de Loyola. Thank you so much, Lodi Kik, sa patuloy na support mo sa channel natin. And Sir IJ is hoping you all the best. So ang tanong is, what is the change in length in centimeters of a steel bar that is heated to 125 degrees Celsius where the coefficient of expansion of steel is 12 microcentimeters per centimeter degree Celsius and the length of 3 meters. So how do we compute for the change in length in this type? So ang tawag kasi dito guys, this is what we call as the thermal expansion. So to find the change in the length, so ang change in length natin mga logic x, that is equal, or sige, gawin na lang natin para mas madali yung symbol na gagamitin natin. Ito na lang. The change in length, that is just equal to the product of the thermal coefficient, oh, uh, sorry, of the, tama, thermal linear expansion coefficient multiplied by the original length multiplied by the change in the temperature. So, ito po yung sinasabi na coefficient of expansion. So, ang coefficient of expansion is naka microcentimeters. ba diba guys? So, anong gagawin natin dyan, Sir IJ? So, alam naman natin na kapag microcentimeters yan, that is, um, since micro siya, gagawin natin siyang 12 times 10 raised to the negative 6 power. So, that is 12 times 10 raised to the negative 6 power. Micro CM. Ay, sorry. It must be CM now, guys. Kasi kinonvert na natin. So that is cm per cm degree Celsius. Um, this is product multiplied by the original length which is 3 meters, right? So kaya lang guys, ang sinabi in terms of centimeters. So anong gagawin natin dyan sir IJ? So ang gagawin natin dyan guys is yung 3 meters convert natin sa centimeters. Alam natin na ang isang metro ay katumbas ng isang daang sentimetro. So, this 3 meters is equivalent to 300 centimeters, right? Multiplied by the change in length. So, kung heated siya up to 125 degrees Celsius, so from the problem itself, we can infer or we can conclude that the change in temperature is equivalent to 125 degrees Celsius. And then, you may just get your calculators and just multiply So we have 12 exponent negative 6 multiplied by 300 multiplied by 125. The correct answer is 9 over 20 or that is 0.45 centimeters. So our answer for this problem is letter C. So kapag nakalimutan po yung formula guys, as what Sir IJ said, dun sa mga past or previous videos natin, try to play with the given. Laruin po yung given guys. So pwede nyong itry, i-multiply lahat or i-multiply mo yung dalawa, divide by the other. So, ganun lang naman yan. Why not add, why not subtract, sir, IJ? Kasi we are applying here dimensional analysis. Dimensional analysis means we are trying to compute or to get the answer in terms of the units given. So, for this case, di ba, ito, micro CM, ginawa mong CM, CM, degree Celsius. Take note na kapag minultiply mo yung 300 CM by the thermal coefficient, or the coefficient of the linear thermal expansion, so yung CM makakancel. Also, the degree Celsius will be canceled, which will leave you with the centimeters na required dun sa problem natin. That is why, kung makalimutan nyo man yung formula, okay lang, for as long na marunong naman kayong maglaro dun sa given. And yun, just in case you have questions or clarifications, huwag po kayo may magtanong sa comment section. And thank you so much to those who keep on supporting our channel. So, 2,000 plus na lang ata, magiging 100,000 subscribers na tayo. So, thank you so much mga Lodi Kicks. I hope we'll end that before the end of the year. And kita kits on my next math tutorial and engineering related tutorial videos. Bye-bye and God bless po.